Good day, ladies and gentlemen. This is your girl, Sean, here, coming to you from my home office here in Boston, Mass. And I just wanted to shoot this quick video. Um, sometimes I talk to people and they tell me that they have a hard time creating um, posts in Canva on their phone. Um, I'm out a lot, and so I don't always have access to my laptop. And so I thought I would shoot this video today to show you uh, how easy it simply is to create a post in Canva. All right. So the first thing you want to do if you already don't have it downloaded is you want to go to your Google Play Store or your i um um or for your iPhone, look into your apps and simply just go in and search for the Canva app. As you can see I've done that and I already again have it downloaded so I can go straight from here and open it. Um or I can show you exactly what I have it on my phone. Um and I simply go to Canva. All right and just going to open it up. Now here you can see, um, well, normally it starts off like this, you see all of the templates that are in Canva. So the same thing you see on your desktop is the same thing that you see on your phone, okay? You can also see, again, your designs, whatever it is that you created, whatever you're working on, all of those things are right here as well. Um, so you know you can always go in again if you want it. Um, I like this uh, setup that I have for my Travel Tip Tuesdays, so I can always go in here simply just uh, tap the three little dots, and I can edit, I can view design, I can resize it, that's if you have Pro, I can rename it. Um, I can also make a copy, and this is a great feature to use, folks. Uh, make a copy if you want to keep the same uh, style of something, but change it out. So I could go in and make a copy of this and then go back in and edit it. So. That is also a great feature to have, okay, um, and to use when you want to create a new design or create another design, um, but using a template that you have previously used. As you can see, um, I have this one here that I created for Travel Tip Tuesday with socks, but then I went in and I actually copied that and made another one um, using uh, that, that same template, okay? So but what we're gonna do in today's video is show you how simple it is to actually create a template or create a post in Canva from your phone. So what we're gonna simply do is hit the plus button and it's going to open up um, our different templates. So as you can see, it has Instagram posts. If I just scroll over, there's your stories, there's your Facebook cover, WhatsApp stories, so on and so forth. So you can pick whichever one um, that you need to work on, okay? For this demonstration, I'm simply going to use my Instagram post. So all I'm gonna do, again, is click the, pl the plus button right here, and it's now going to open it up, okay? Now it simply says, tap something to start editing. So all I'm gonna do is tap on the white screen, and now as you can see, I have uh, my gallery, I have images from Canva, and then I have colors. If you have brand colors, again, you can select those if you want to use them, okay? Again, you go to your gallery, you might have your own pictures that you wanna use for that. You simply find the picture that you wanna use and then just simply um, upload it. So I might wanna take, for instance, let's just say, um, let's just go with this one right here, okay? This one's actually from a recent flight I just had. so. I'm going to use this picture and I'm simply going to hit the plus button now because I simply want to start adding some text to it. Now when you click the plus button again, you can see you can add text, you can add image, you can add video, stickers, illustrations, templates, logos, so on and so forth. You can even add another page. So if you're creating a few different posts and you want to do it all at one time, you can just simply click on page and it will add another page for you. Okay. Um, but in this case, I'm just simply going to delete that page for now. All right. And go back to my original. Actually, let's not delete the whole page. Um, so I can just go here. And then you can simply just hit um, the trash button, okay? And go back there. So now I'm back to my original template. <clears throat> so again, I'm simply going to add some text to this. I'm going to add my own text. And I don't like to try to fit everything on one line, so I might do this a few times. So let me see. Okay, now all I wanna do is start to type out what I'm going to post, what I'm going to create. And for this, I'm doing a travel trivia post. So I'm just gonna put some text in here. So travel trivia Tuesday, 
okay and then again you can highlight that and you can drag it move it up or down as you can see you can change the font here as well um, if you have a favorite font that you use you can pick that um, you'll see the ones with the little crowns by it those are for if you have Canva Pro so you can use those other than that then you use the ones that you have here so you just you find your font that you like simply click the check button again you can change the size you can just right now it's a 38 take the bar and you can just kind of scroll across you can make it as big as you want or as small as you want all right and again I can take this and bring it out a little bit more and bring it up all right again you can also change the color on this as well if you didn't want the black again you could uh, pick a color that's here or you can simply click the plus button and then you can um, find your colors here if you want you can move it around or move the bar around this way and um, you know change the colors to desired colors that you want once you find a color you want just simply click the check button and you're all set okay so now the next thing I want to do is I want to still add some more text so I'm just simply going to hit the plus button I'm going to hit text again and I'm going to add some text and now I'm going to put my question okay okay let me see there you go so now I'm just going to put my question here so which one is not a Caribbean country I'm going to put a question mark now I don't like the red um, on this so I'm simply going to as you can see I just tapped it it highlighted it I'm just simply going to change this color to um, black okay and I don't know if I want the same type style as I have for the travel trivia Tuesday so again I can simply go in change the font uh, to something else um, and again there's so many in Canva um, even on the free version <clears throat> so it might be great to just um simply you know <clears throat> excuse me go through and maybe find the fonts that you like so you know which ones that you're using uh, when you're creating a post okay and the last thing I'm going to do is simply hit the plus button again and I'm going to add some more text um, I don't like it to be all um, all together so I like to kind of break it out so I'm just going to give them some options here I said Cuba um, Zanzibar uh, what else we got? Puerto Rico. Oops. Let me see. Puerto Rico. Okay. And let's see. My next one is Haiti. Okay. Again, I don't like the red on this. I'm just going to simply highlight it. I'm going to change it back to black. Um, or if I want another color again, I could do that. I'm just going to kind of spread this out a little bit. All right. Again, if you don't like the color, you don't like the way it looks, you don't like the type style, we can change the type style again as well. And I might simply change it to that. Okay. And, you know, I can now add my logo to it if I want, if you have it on your computer. Um, you can on your phone you simply just go here and you go to logos and you can you see I don't have one here and add a new logo and I can go in now it's actually I forgot on this it is part of the pro but if you do have the pro you can add your logo um, now I know also that you can add your logo now it's funny because on the phone you, you have to have pro but you can uh, actually add it if you're on your computer so sometimes what I'll do is if I if I can't add my logo here I might simply just go back into adding a little bit of text and what I'll simply do here is I'll bring it down and here I might just put an at sign and my uh, my travel name here okay and you can make it again make that bigger you can make it smaller you can um again change the color if you like if you don't want the red maybe you want yellow 
whatever the case is, you can kind of change it and just leave it that way. Now, if you really do want to add your logo to this um, post, then what I simply suggest is go ahead and create it here if you want. If you're not in a rush to post it, um, create it here. And when you log into your computer or in, log into Canva, it will be there. So now you can go back in and still edit it and add the logo and stuff if you so choose. I'm not really sure why you can't do it. Uh, sorry about that. Um, but that's how you simply create a post in Canva. I'm simply just going to hit the download button. And it's going to prepare, prepare my design and save it. As you can see, successfully saved. And I am all set, folks. That is how you create a simple post um, in Canva. All right. And as you can see, it's right there. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, don't, uh, please feel free to ask. All right. Until next video, guys. Thanks.